It's very important that we prove whether an intervention and approach is working or not. And there are several approaches which prove to be effective. One of them is cognitive reframing and that directly influences the quality of life. And that's a way to uh, reframe what you are thinking. For instance, if you are thinking that dementia is a disaster, that you can't do anything anymore, then, then you really have a hard time. So it's, it's important that people learn to deal differently with it, to see it what it is at the moment, and that it's not a total disaster. But so it, the cognitive reframing is another way at looking at, uh, at the problem not, a, not making it a total disaster, but making it smaller, just making it what it is. Another way, for instance, is occupational therapy, which is aimed at, um, at complying with the needs of persons with dementia and especially the needs for um, continuing daily life. So, for instance, simple things like making coffee, and uh, another one is uh, pl uh, pleasurable activities because you, you can continue living and continue doing um, pleasant activities and that's what we all like. So these interventions are interventions you can also apply to a person we call completely healthy because we all have the tendency to, if something is bothering us, to make it a big disaster. And, uh, and we all like pleasurable activities and we all need to take time out for pleasurable activities. So what I'm also doing now is that I want to make a plea to uh, facilitate normal things for persons with dementia. That means that we should not only focus on care, but that we should focus on normal life and that we should consider persons with dementia as other human beings. Usually, um, researchers or organizations uh, give the idea for uh, intervention, but it might be better to do the other way around, that we look what people with dementia need, and whether they need an intervention, whether they need care or something else, and that we make a choice based on what they want and that we include them in the decision-making uh, process.